Welcome back, fellow citizens of JAR, to dinner and for Super President. This is the show in which we try to build our own country, take over the entire universe, and fix all of the universe's problems. If that sounds like something you think you might like, please hit the subscribe button down below to be counted as a citizen and to join us on our path to glory. I'm not sure how visible it is, but I've put the astroturf in. I think it looks hilarious and I love it. Let's get into the community show, shall we? We need more dirt, Darren. It's getting a bit crowded on the land we have. I think we are like almost perfectly caught up with the correct, because I actually have a, a ruler now that we need to follow. I think we're like 50 away from another spoonful. Because the jar is full at 10,000, there's a very specific scale I'm following now, so. Doing well. Tiny Dino saying that the version of Happy Birthday they were going is based off of going the like Happy Birthday, Happy Birthday, Happy Birthday to you, which is scary. I've never heard it, and it it challenges the way that I've grown up seeing the world. So it's wrong by definition. That's how people work nowadays, right? <laughs> I'm very sassy today. I just went for a jog and I haven't showered. I don't know why anybody else needs to know that, but I do. I've had several people saying they would actually wear jar merch. So, uh, how's this? You all get me to 800, I'll figure something out. Where could I send you the national anthem? Should I just write it in the comments of a video? I'll comment on your comment. But you could also just, you could comment it, email it, read it, anywhere, really. We'll find it. Why do you have turf? <laughs> You see, this is the fun part. I'd like to say that I went out and specifically bought turf for that video because I'm like super amazing. But the reality is, <laughs> it's the same reason that I was super tanned in all my really old videos. I used to work in landscaping and we had some extra turf left over. So I took some home. And then every day in the morning when I drink my coffee, I'd run my toesies through the grass and I'd go, coffee and then my toes would feel great. And I even had one under my old videos when I was sitting up. So I'd put my, my toes in the grass as I recorded. And now you know. <laughs> and this goes to show how weird I am in my off time. Another wonderful community moment of thanks and giving and warmth and happiness. You're all lovely, wonderful people. You should put an image of the jar in the jar. Do I then have to put an image of the jar on the image? Because this, I see where this is going and I'm not Ant-Man. I don't have the ability to get that small. I can't even get my arm in the Pringles can. This is, we, I'm gonna have issues on this one. Uh, misspelled going on a journey, basically going through how many subs we have and then deciding to rickroll all of us at the end of it. Even straight up saying, ha, get rickrolled. That's exactly how I wanted to start my Monday. Talking about medicine, just talk about antidepressants. All you need to do is talk about your vids. I feel like the Grinch, as my heart has grown three sizes that day. <laughs> well, genuinely, thank you. I, if I ever have the option, I always like seeing if I can make people happy with my videos. So, to see that it works every now and again is, uh, very affirming, so. Yeah, no jokes there, I'm just... But thanks. <laughs> it's FLD going on a multi-week journey to say that we really should make a Discord server. I see that you want us to make a Discord server. I'm aware. <laughs> I don't like the idea of people being left out, and I feel like if I made a Discord, there would be the people in the Discord who were like, well, we're the real JAR citizens, and then there would be the people who just watch being like, feeling left out or like they missed something. So maybe I'm wrong on that. I don't know how you all feel about that, but that's how I kind of feel it might turn out. And it's not really what I'm going for. Wow, you actually used the website I said in my comment. Also, we could make our own socket just because. I definitely did. I had very little time and I was like, I really need to get a video out. And I was just scrolling for quick ideas and, and you made my Friday much easier. So thank you. <laughs> I've seen multiple people saying we should use the happy plug, uh, and then Jesse saying that we should use two mail outlets so that people have to be very careful not to risk injury or death and just to keep people on their toes. <laughs> I enjoy health and safety, so I'm gonna say very, it's a wonderful idea <laughs> in concept, but at least for now, we'll go with the happy plug. <laughs> Joy is also shocked to find that there are so many plug types. I was also shocked to find out there are so many plug types. I may have hit record before I scrolled all the way down the page and thought that there would only be like four or five. <laughs> I also like that for suggestions of other types of videos for me to make if I don't have time, we have two distinct kinds. We have Aiden and some random guy going with the silly end of it saying, list every type of beard and every potato. 
And then on the flip side, Ms. Build making pretty much an encyclopedia of topics that I can use to make videos. You will see videos from that list. Thank you. This is always nice to get free ideas. <laughs> I do have ideas. I'm not running out of ideas. Just some of the ideas I have take research. So this has been your super presidential candidate Darren signing off for Monday saying, welcome to JAR. JAR takes all kinds. You are family now. Don't forget to check the description down below for some links to some fun things. And I will leave you as always with our viewer submitted model for JAR, which is we are JAR. If you love JAR, you'll love us. See you Saturday. And this episode is brought to you by Rachel and also Luke. Because if I had to list every potato and beard in the world, <laughs> I, know, I, know, I know Luke would be in the beard types. Which I'm, I guess, Rachel, you're a potato. So, <laughs> I don't even know where I'm going with this.